You know what they say, if you can telly Washington, you can telly anywhere in the world. And if you're a real Washingtonian, you telly at Stevens Pass. Chances are you've heard of Stevens Pass, probably recently due to the constant social media battle between the community and the new mountain owners. Not to mention, we're getting well into the season, and the majority of our terrain and lifts are still closed. So who are we, and why are we here? We're just a little group of Telemark skiers trying to bring the stoke back to Stevens. Our team is quite diverse. We've got a couple wonderful ladies that are learning to telly this year. We're skipping the carpet. Yep, now stand up straight. <laughs> that one should be down that way. Oh no, dropping in switch. <laughs> Their struggle was real, but at the same time, they were skiing for real. So how we doing? We also ride with this sage guy. He is the self-proclaimed coolest guy on the hill at any given moment. Here we have yours truly, mostly just spun in circles for the entire season, a kind of a one-trick show. And how could we forget about this hoser? Sure, he scores us some points, but he is obnoxious. Yeah, for me, Talbark Skid is, it's really just all about the vibes. It gives you the freedom to really just take things to the next level. Stevens Pass needs the community and the culture to be saved. It's been snuffed out. It's like turning off the lights. So we're gonna bring it back. We've got some plans to save Stevens. And I think telemark skiing is, is integral to that. Despite our big plans to save Stevens, we were disappointed with the state of our mountain to say the least. So we did what any sad tele skiers would do in our position. We headed to Canada to kick the season off right. Yeah, I man, I'm not gonna drop any knees probably up uh, here. What did you just fucking say? We're gonna drop some yeah, knees. Yeah, we're gonna drop some knees. How we doing, experts? Sudan Kular. Ripping pretty hard at Whistler. We came to Whistler to kind of figure out why Stevens Pass is having so many problems, but we can't really see anything, so. You know. When we got back to Stevens, however, we could see clearly not much had changed. In order to get people smiling again, we had to show everybody just how fun tele skiing can be. At some point, Cropper decided he was cool enough to try and become a worldwide tele sensation. What up, Tele Daddy? Tele Craw here on chair 69. How we doing? Wow. Yeah, with the seat. We realized that in order to save Stevens, we were going to need to get as many people on Telemark as possible. <laughs> there you go, yeah. Drop the knee and the ski will get out of your way. Oh, the most natural thing on skis. Shout out Rise to Telemark. Thanks for the gear. A true natural. I mean, if your turns look like that on your first day. You know what it is, baby. How we doing, how we doing, how we doing, how we doing? What do we got out here? Oh, baby. That's one. That's two. Oh, God. That's a three sausage day, baby. Well, I 
was driving through the country. Hey, Telly Patrol, any tips for a first time Telly skier? How we doing? Uh, yeah, I kind of sit into it. Yeah, I mean, really, you just want to kind of get the feeling of a little bit. I saw her coming from a distance. Dude, I didn't know patrol fell down. Uh, I think that this is kind of the entrance to A5. Right, let's go for the Twitter. And she was She asked me, do you need assistance? I could not speak, I just grew still. Dude, nice boots. You want to trade? Yeah, let's trade. Wait, you got to do the other foot first. Why? Because I got to step into something. There you go. So sloppy. Oh my god. Holy shit. Why are they so loose, Brian? Oh. This is horrible. Shout out to Proski Seattle. It's for my new scarf for TX Pros. Woo! Come on, break them in. Take a looky here. 25, 26 inches of snowpack in the backyard. How we doing? John wants you to drop a knee in the lift line. There you go. John, Jelly Legend. You got it here first. Another shout out to Jayco. Thanks so much for helping with our awesome team sticker. I think I've got a nice spot for it. Love that smell in the morning. I like them crispy. You know, the thing I think people don't realize about Stevens Pass is it's just such a free space. It's a pretty free space. And so free. A lot of the time, you can't see anything. How's that? Feeling free? Oh yes! Getting pretty hungry? Yeah, we're here at the top of Squirrel Trail. No matter if they're full on tots or just a pile of potatoes, they're delicious. All in all, things were going pretty well at Steve. But when Tahoe calls, you answer. High point on Heavenly. How we doing? How we doing, baby? All right, gonna do a little free heel scan. The Montana dreams change with the seasons. We're dreaming up ways to survive. <laughs> Whoa, like he's so low! I was trying to flip you into walk mode. And I've gathered up my share of milk and honey. And all those honey dudes are done. Well, I don't hibernate like some bears do. I like to have a little fun. Well, it's time to have a little fun. Let's go skiing. Woods all cutting in the shed. And dancing through my mind are all those virgin of track lines. And it's no good foot before I went to bed. And in Montana, it is the season. And all the world turns shades of gray. Rocky Mountain High from the face shots we received the live long day. Meets in the freezer, let's go skiing. Wow, that was short. Conditions are great. This is sadistic. Can I go backwards? No, we can't. I can't please. No. Oh, shit. 
Okay. <laughs> Target acquired. Harris. Heavenly base area. Smells like fucking shit. Literally, like possibly somebody just pooped on the ground. Hey, can I get everybody's attention real quick? I just want to let you all know that I am a telly skier. Yeah, he is. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> Nobody cares. Nobody cares. Still only now 50 cents, my guy. Up the multipliers. Come on. Uh, how we doing? <laughs> With the ski boots on, dude. Back at home, just in time for World Telemark Day, we heard the news. Sven and Glenn is on. Just tacking telly skis, baby. <laughs> it was time to have the telly weekend of a lifetime. <laughs> that uphill ski drops. Whoa, wrong one, bud. Other way. <laughs> Happy World Telemark Day! Free the heel! Woo! Going backwards already! The video is gonna be like bullshit. He's not here. <laughs> no, we have How are you doing? How are you doing? <laughs> Liv, how old are you? 11. You're 11 years old and you love telemark skiing? <laughs> After a two year hiatus, we finally kicked and screamed enough and got it back. The Spen and Glenn race. The two telly legends live on. All right, Telly Craw on course. Three, two, one, go. Got it! Yeah! What's your name? What's your number of days on Telemark equipment? First. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Good Gregoire, 50 years old, A number one. There we go. What's your name? I'm Kim. I'm 43. First time, baby. Is that your first time on Telly Ski Spots? Yeah. Drop it in. It was at this moment, with nearly 20 people on Telemark skis ripping down Skyline, that we realized we had truly done something special. We had saved Stephen's pass. That's at least about a foot of pal. Foot of pal? Wow, they were only reporting seven inches this morning. How we doing? Dropping some knees. Telecraw update. Macy. Quick Telecraw update. We are switch dual telepress knee to ski drinking a Coors Light on a magic carpet in a tunnel. I think that's points. Cheers, CJ. Quick telecraw update. Yeah. Telecraw update. Yo, Nate, where do you work again? Right here online. Yeah, that's, uh, that's points. Shit bad for telly. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, we couldn't have asked for a better season. The new friends, the memories, and the overwhelming love for Steven's past will not soon be forgotten. How we doing? <laughs>